And there I was, dick deep in water. Off spawn. <laughs> Fuck, dude. I honestly, I am looking forward to playing paintball again next year, especially if everybody's in. Like, that's gonna be a lot of fun. Is that what's happening? Yeah. Oh, bro. So the last one that I just faced, right? She had, uh, what was it called? It's like detonation, and she's here, fighting my dog. I am back oh, yeah, here. Seen, yeah, this like over here, and I still got hit by it. Yeah. And I was like, bro, what? Wait, hold on. Oh wait, no, we're almost there. Never mind. I was gonna say, let's do that so that way you run faster. But we're right here. Oh no. Yeah. Uh, oh no. Oh, uh, I mean, I can actually. I, yeah, I gotta go back to Ward 13 anyway, so. I, I remember this fight very well. Mm. We could skip it. And, th and that'll get you another mod for weapons. If you wanted to skip it. Oh, that's why. You're on a different... Oh, never mind. The pumpkins stayed dead. The there's pumpkins everywhere. I I feel like there's something... So <gasps> you lucky motherfucker. God damn it. Do you have any idea how fucking long that took? Do you have any idea? Ripened heart. Yeah, do you have any idea how long that took? Next year we'll bring flowers. Uh, like five seconds. I so I had to plant this tree from that seed that we get on Yesha, that weird ass oh. seed. Planted that. Then you have to wait three in game days for this tree to grow. Then you have to get the celestial thane fruit. You have to get that to spawn three times. Guess how long that takes? Nobody has any fucking idea because it changes level when you are in the world and then you come back to Ward 13. That's when it changes that thing right there. That changes from that to a bigger green one, to a slightly gold one, to a glowing gold one. And the glowing gold one, if you eat it, an ancient fruit that is harvested at its highest form after consuming... Upon death, the hero will be revived with 50% health and be immune to status effect for 30 seconds. Huh. Yeah. I'll give you a 30 second status effect. Best 30 seconds of your life. Well, all I have to say is that GG. That's easy. all I'm good for. Um, That's all I'm good for. Well, look at you. Mm. Lucky. It only took me. Lucky motherfucker, dude. Seconds. Yeah. Something that I literally had to, like, do research for and wait days to get. This motherfucker walks in, he's like, oh, cool, a thing. Wait, are you talking about this long gold thing that I'm looking at right now? Yeah. <laughs> I got one, too. What does it look like? So, long gone? Or, I'm sorry, deceit? Can it be November 11th already? Philion. God damn it. Corrupted what, what? Merciless. And I can at least play a new Call of Duty at 1040 at night and not be bored. I mean, you got what? 11 days. I'll be back Tuesday. 11 days. And... It's 11 days too many. Dude. Yeah. 11 days is for the... I have no interest in playing <laughs> Call of Duty multiplayer at this moment in time. But I yeah. will not play Warzone by myself. Hmm. Oh, wait. Are they going to have raids in the new one? That is one thing I wish. There is still a raid camo I want. And I have the ability to do it. I just need people to do it with. I Actually, I was talking with TJ the other day. I'm like, you know what? Like, I'm, I'm down to do raids if... Josh's because I had fun in the like the one or two we did. I already yeah. did it. 
it was actually fun to play. So the I, I think it's the season four raid or whatever to get the green camo mm -hmm. that's like mm -hmm. moving. Yeah. I I completed it once with people randoms and we were gonna do it on veteran and when we got to the juggernaut spot at the end which is literally the last part of the fucking mission they left so that was dope so i literally was five minutes away from getting the camo and then they decided to just suck my whole ass wait this merciless has a magazine of three and does 90 damage Oh, yeah, it's a completely different gun. Yeah. I, I need 10 Corrupted Shards now, so should join you. Oh, dude, the, the Corrupted... It, yeah, it's got... No, I think 12 is the normal magazine. I, think. I do have to say, the uh, Souls camo that they put out for this Halloween season is dope. Mm -hmm. I'm so happy that I, I was smart enough and saved up. Okay, I'm buying the Merciless. I don't oh, think I can have more than uh, 10 Corrupted Shards, which pisses me off. That's interesting. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Now my shit is max oh, level. Zero. It still has three shots. Wait. It looks it... cooler. Yeah, it does. Holy shit. Oh, uh, what am I going to put on it? I mean, I got... Increase this weapon's range damage by 5% for every reserve ammo. Oh. For every 20% reserve ammo missing. When the weapon runs out of ammo, it gains infinite ammo for 5 seconds. Oh my god. Uh, that one. No, I like this one a lot better. Kill switch. Switching to this weapon creates an, explo an explosive burst which deals 50 damage to all enemies within 7 meters. That means literally going like that. And it only takes like 8 to 10 seconds. Oh yeah, I didn't even look at this new relic because I was so furious that you also got it. 35 health over 0.5 seconds and an additional 70 health over... That's not good either. And we still have a long reload. Why? It's a three shot weapon, dude. Um, I'm just gonna make sure I don't have like any reload rings on. Can you set it? Oh, this gives it a much faster reload. What does? The mod for it. Bro, is like parts of it missing when I'm doing the reload? Why is the barrel smoking? Uh oh. What the fuck? Yeah. That's weird. I love it. So, this one looks like it has ED at the tip. That one looks correct. Bloodshot. While active, grants unlimited reserve ammo and increases reload speed by 30%. If the entire magazine hits a weak spot, Merciless will automatically perform a quick reload. That's why. Okay, that makes sense. Um, I feel like I have a build for this. Granted, it's this one. That still takes fucking forever. And as soon as I put the weapon on, it explodes. Okay, that's sick. Love that for me. Uh, micro compressor isn't gonna help me. What if I use Farron's Sigil? Critical and weak spot hits generate 10% additional mod power, which would definitely help. Or Zanya's Malice would be really good. Or I just stack reload speed on this motherfucker. Think you can handle this? Two shots sent a mass and one to the head. Stop most of your problems. I'm not gonna lie, I hate fucking everybody in this game that talks. This guy, I was over here making builds, 
would not shut. I've heard that line literally 8,000 times. Holy shit. So loud. And he doesn't shut up. Do I have a silly come? I do. Got max on the ray gun. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna max out the room pistol because I'm pretty sure that's the gun that I'm gonna do next. You know where to find me. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna finish maxing out the rest of my weapons because I have 25 grand somehow. Never mind. There's only 10 levels. Great. Really? I'm out of galvanized iron? You're Are you shitting me? Actually, I kind of wonder what it's going to do with these two skills. Shut up. And she doesn't have any more galvanized. Okay. I feel like this is not going to be a good character for this just because I'm moving so slow. So I'll go back to him. Love that for me. Actually, I could make an entire build just around that explosion, too. Switch to that. And switch to that. And I mean, that's going to make me get less money. And I could change that to amplitude. And that might give me. That might give me more range on that. I don't know. I I, I, I want to see what happens. <clears throat> Touch the rock. Is that a rock? It's a boulder. Everybody says it backwards. I know. I'm wondering if that, like, if this gun, like, if you hit somebody with this, if they just fucking explode into blood, that'd be pretty sick. Be pretty sick, yeah. <clears throat> uh, I mean, I could switch this up to where I'm not gonna take any fire damage, but there's also. also mostly not fire damage it's mostly the sword damage that it hits you Ooh, or wait do you want to do you want to skip the fight i forgot nah uh, well no but it gives you a different mod it gives you the the chains mod that turns you into scorpion where you sure. can where you can literally like get over here bitch uh so That's what right. we're looking for is his guards and we need six holy shit oh my god the reload dude just reload I like the explosion. I'm sad that I'll I have to wait to play Call of Duty until the that Tuesday after. Yeah. But I'll also use you guys as an indicator on how about to do the Yeah. Oh yeah, Josh, did you, did you ever read that message or something on Discord? 
Um. So I tried to, but if I'm being honest, I didn't. So it's a it's a comment I on one of my didn't shorts. It. Yeah. I, so yeah. I remember you talking about it was the the game where we were I think where we were all sniping, right? Uh, no, it's it, it was literally the game right before I was like, man, this longbow is nuts, or this kid's cheating. And, okay. I was like, and then we tried the longbow, we were like, oh no, the longbow is literally just nuts, never mind. Like, guy wasn't cheating, obviously. Or was he? What the fuck? I killed myself on my own shit. Um, yeah, I see that. Yeah. Oh. Thanks. There was a lot of stuff that we just got. I don't know what I'm saying. I just yeah. actually find red. That guy is so fucking you faggot homos. That's one thing I did say about um this game is I don't understand how they implemented ricochet anti cheat so well come the end of Call of Duty la like war for like Warzone One and stuff. And now they have it saying that it's gonna release and it's gonna be fine and it's just absolutely dog shit still. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's fucking yeah, Activision. I don't know. Every, everything they touch literally turns to shit. Like, it's insane. Like, it's not, it's not Call of Duty's fault that they, you know, hey, this is, this is the world that we're in now, is that it's not the wrong way. God damn it. So we're looking for those guard guys that teleport and stuff. That's, like, that's who we're looking for right now. I don't remember how to get out of here. 